Well guys, it's Welsh Randy SG here, bringing you another video into the Manager Mode show. It is the end of month, and just the end of month for report. A lot of players improving, such as Nicky Maynard, Olsen, Fan Man, and also uh, M Miloff. I need to pra practice his name, I haven't exactly practice it. But we have got a few players going down, since so right now somebody is old, we have to give it to him. But the players who have played have been playing really well, you can see here... Um, I've played uh, Wickham once and he's already gone up. So, into our first game, which is against uh, Liverpool. We are playing at Anfield. This is the, in the Premier League. So, I am kind of hoping we can easily get the win here. Or even just leave Anfield with a point. Because uh, recently we've playing, been playing well. In the last month or uh, month and a half, we've been playing really well. But we get very fortunate here. We do get a penalty given to us in the 11th minute, something like that. A uh, 15th minute, actually. And we do bury it with Nicky Maynard. So, I was really happy with that. Especially seven up on the big stage for him to actually score. Nicky Maynard guy's a really good player. Maybe considering buying in him in your actual season three. Maybe one or two. I don't know what to think of him. But uh, we do end up 35 minutes, 50 minutes later, we do end up drawing one all. But straight after, guys, we get hit with the double whammy. Charge a keeper out. We have got Fat Man in goals. We've been playing well lately. But unfortunately, we do end up conceding again in the 38th minute. Going 2 1 down. 45th now. We're going to get hit. With the triple whammy, we have to give it to him. Great pass and play, but terrible defending on my end. Especially with, like, we, we found the perfect formation as well, which we started playing well with. But unfortunately, we haven't been playing well with it in this game. So, um, at half time, I do change the formation. I do go with a 4 1 2 and 2 instead of just the 4 3 1 2, which we've been playing. And I do uh, make some several substitutions as well. Um, Liverpool as well, they're on the ball now, charging through. They just seem to break through my defence rather easily. But we do have Nelson and Baker actually started in the centre back. So, we have got the guy who's kind of not playing really well and also we got the guy who's uh, just starting his career in the game so we kind of have that bit like oh we haven't got exactly got the best defense in the world but I was really disappointed with the result um, we could have left with at least a point in my opinion and the way we played in the second half we could have won the game but we do move down to set from fifth uh, not still good I'm still aiming around that seventh play mark to try and get in Europe but, but we have got Euro game now against Bran uh, we do change the formation to a 4-3-3 Three, trying out uh, Dyer and also Rojas down those wings, see if they can actually play well. And also we got Nicky Maynard on his own. But around the 10th minute now, they do go through on goal with Orja. And really disappointing you that we actually concede with Farman in goals. I was actually considering changing him after that uh, humiliating defeat against Liverpool. But I thought, no, I'll try and keep him, I'll keep him in, see if he can build his confidence up. But he didn't play well at all in my opinion. I'm um, into the second half now. Uh, we do make some substitutions. We do bring on Solazano and also Enric Larson. We take off Hurd, which did have a buck in, and also we do take off Dyer. Um, so we do go 2 <laughs> 0 down. Um, poor defending again, but poor positioning on the goalkeeper. Um, my defending lately hasn't been rather well. It's been re really disappointing, but we do kind of come back into it a little bit in the 70th minute. Charging through, but uh, Solazano on the ball again. Now getting a shot away, and uh, unfortunately just misses. Uh, at the moment, we kind of relying on uh, Solazano too much at the moment. But uh, if we play with like uh, Nicky Main on Defoe, they play really well. But if you play one without the other, they don't seem to play well at all. But I've got some custom tactics after losing our game. I was like, something got to be changed. But we do make some custom tactics. I do add the speed up to 100. I have got short passing, positioning, free roam. Uh, pass uh, creations, we got a lot of normal creations. Also, crossing, we got lots. Shooting of lots. Uh, positioning, free roam a little bit. And aggression around the 75th uh, percent. And uh, we have got a different formation. We are going with a 4 4 1 1 again. But we have got my little custom tactics on it. We've got the left midfield and the right midfielder slightly pushed up. And also, we do have the centre forward slightly more closer to the striker. Just slightly playing off that striker. And hopefully it does play out well. And we do uh, 40th minute now. We get very fortunate here on the shot. But I'll have to give it to Solizano. Who actually started this game. As I give him the credit to actually get in that position. But we do have a deflection. Quite surprised how it counted. Was aimed for that right. But it did go into that bottom left. But in the second half, uh, Everton played really well in this game. It wasn't exactly like I was constantly attacking, attacking. It was kind of one of those games which are end-to-end. -end. Lucas Piazzone on the ball now. Solizano does get a penalty. You have a blatant penalty there. He just taps it to the right a little bit. And he does end up getting past him. Barnum again, guys. A lot of you suggested start playing him. Yes, I do. 
and his 57th minute and he does get a goal and uh, one of the best penalty takers in the team as well so a great player guys and I think you should actually get him great acceleration as well as passing and whatnot great centre midfielder uh, 63th minute now guys uh, Everton on the ball great save by our goalkeeper we actually changed the goalkeeper around this game we do put uh, Milalov, uh, Milalov in goals and uh, he does play and he does show uh, great potential as well especially his rating in going up from 83 to 84 after just a few ma few games which is awesome especially as he, ha he hasn't actually played all those games as well which is uh, pretty good but by here we uh, get very lucky in my opinion uh, to actually not concede a goal but in the 75th minute now we got some uh, lovely passing play you watch now Banner on the ball now to uh, Lucas Pierre's zone, 1 2 passing, and look at that lovely. It was a shame that you couldn't get a better shot off or even run it through a little bit more. But anyway, I was really happy with this result, um, especially winning 2 0, especially coming back from a 3 1 defeat and a 2 0 defeat to come back and win 2 0 against a team like Everton. I'll have to give it to him. Uh, we do still stay sick for uh, one point behind Tottenham and a few points in front of Liverpool. Really happy at the moment with the team, guys. Guys, thank you very much for watching, and I will catch you guys next time. I hope you enjoy the video guys and I hope you stay tuned and come back tomorrow. Bye guys.